type of the antique Rome, rich reliquary of lofty contemplation left to time by buried centuries of pomp and power at length at length after so many days of weary pilgrimage and burning thirst thirst for the springs of lore that in thee lie i kneel an altered and a humble man amid thy shadows and so drink within my very soul thy grandeur, gloom, and glory. Fastness and age and memories of eld, silence and desolation and dim night, I feel ye now, I feel ye in your strength, O spells more sure than e'er Judean king, taught in gardens of Gethsemane, O charms more potent than rapt Chaldee ever drew down from the quiet stars. Here, where a hero fell, a column falls. Here, where a mimic eagle glared in gold, a midnight vigil holds the swarthy bat. Here, where the dames of Rome their gilded hair waved to the wind, now wave the reed and thistle. Here, where on the golden throne the monarch lolled, glides specter-like unto his marble throne, lit unto, unto his marble home, lit by the wan light of the horned moon, the swift and silent lizard of the stones. But stay, these walls, these ivy-clad arcades, these moldering plinths, these sad and blackened shafts, these vague entablatures, these crumbling frieze, this shattered cornices, this wreck, this ruin, these stones, alas, gray stones, all they are, all of the famed and colossal left by corrosive hours. And fate to me? Not all. The echoes answer me, not all. Prophetic sounds and loud arise forever. From us, from all ruin unto the wise. As melody from Memnon to the sun, we rule the hearts of the mightiest men. We rule with a despotic sway in all great minds. We are not impotent, we pallid stones. Not all our power is gone, not all our fame. Not all the magic of our high renown, not all the wonders that encircle us, not all the mysteries that in us lie, not all the memories that hang upon and cling around us like a garment, clothing us in a robe of more than glory.